Hi guys, it's Daisy Demands, and in this episode of Daisy Plays, we are going to be doing Frambo Part 6, I believe. I think it's 6, it's either 5 or 6. But we are with Itwood now, so without further ado, let's get into it. Let's play the game. Because this is a long ass game. Right. Take my. <gasps> oh, I got some tape. Uh, a hammer. A wooden foot. Uh, ooh, a map about sh shoes. Shoe? Feet? Real feet shoes. Okay. That's always good, isn't it? Hmm. Let's go this way. Button? What button? Oh, there we go. There is a button. Oh, look! It's kitty! 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 What's this? Spinning thing. Tubes. Pencil. What's this? What's this? Boiler, maybe? Oh, there's a leak. Oh, I've got some duct tape. Right, let's try this. There's no gas. Like pilot. Okay, well there's something to do there. I don't know what I need to do. What the hell is that? Tubing. Tubing. Uh, does that need to go there? No. Gas? Is that the gas? Did that? Oh, jibbing out. Don't crash. Oh my god, is that me with eyeballs? I forgot to give myself some love. Seconds and minutes and hours and days. Tick tock. Tick tock. I forgot to understand you. Okay. I, I don't... There's an eyeball. Oh, there's a pipe thing. Okay. Is that what I needed, maybe? Yeah, to look maybe over here. Something is working. Okay. I don't know what we're meant to do with these, but these have tubings. No, nope, I don't know. Okay, well, I'm gonna go and see something else now. What's in here? Oh, cool! Um. Oh, okay. It's not the light switch. No. Okay. Why would I need that? Hmm. Okay. Oh, looks the king. Do I have a key? What's this? Okay, can't open that. Okay, there's everything that I can't open. Oh, fork wall. Okay, well I can't go that way. 
Can I talk to you? Sir, can you tell me again what I am supposed to do? Sure, get the fuel mixed when the water pump working. Just follow the wall newel. Wall newels? <laughs> wall newels? It's like a manual, but on walls. Okay. You cryptic bitch. Ugh, oh, what's this? Reality view, ultra reality view. Okay, chemical mixture. N116. N. That's N116. Is that N116? No, it's N166. R15. R15 I don't know why my game is jibbing out a little bit R15 2PF Right, surely I could put like some tubing. Well, that worked. See if we can fix this. Need water. Do you need water? Okay. Hold on. What's this? be there. Pretty sure it needs to be there. Fully that way. Right, is that connected? Is that all done? This says it has no gas. Oh, there we go. Ooh. Are you... are you here to kill Itwood? I'm very sorry for what I did. I hope you can forgive me. Hello, why won't you talk to me? Oh, that's creepy. I've got key now. Oh, key. Mwah. That music, man, it always gets me. It's like a shiver down my spine. Let's open the lock. There you go, let's see what happens. In a world made of darkness and light. Two little sisters tried to steal each other's charm. But neither side could decide. If what they were... If what they was was just right. That was a bit of a tongue twister. Mia was angry and Clara was sad. And this was because they both were mad. Oh, insane little girls. 
inside of their minds. Itward, the creature of the night. He always came around in dreams or reality, teaching the girls the splendor of duality. But they couldn't understand. Itward was a friend. Itward was the link between the darkness and the light. He was grey. But Clara and Mia one day decided to get rid of Itward once and for all. Die, creature of the night, die, they said. But they killed each other instead. Dead and gone. The sisters kept complaining about each other. It's all your fault, Clara. It's all your fault, Mia. Then Itwood came to visit for the last time. And he said, You are both trapped in a world of disconnections. But I'll give you a chance. The world has been mean to you. They sewed your bodies together to prove that they could. They gave you a mirror to compare yourselves. I'll give you nothing but what you already have. And just one tiny little chance to understand the purpose of life. But the clock is ticking. You have until the day a black cat goes missing and the well's magic door is unlocked. The end. Oh, that was when I went into the well. Okay, well, that was strange. Can I open this door now? No, nope, that's the light switch. Can I open this door now? No. Okay, let's get back to whatever this is right oh yes finally okay things are happening fire berries in there fire berries in somewhere in that one. Oh, in that one Fire berries that aren't on fire. I feel like I'm missing something. <gasps> There's a game? Oh my god. Oh my god. Well, I never. Oh, God. Oh my god, this is so cool! Has anybody found this? Oh Christ. Oh no, I'm gonna die. Oh god, I'm gonna die. Oh 
How many rounds is it? More- oh my god, there's a giant chicken! Is that an Easter egg? Unpredicted behaviour from the Itwood computer machine database. It has been found. It it work has been shut down. Egg Easter allowed. Zero zero one zero one stop. Oh my god! Oh my god, it was there. It was right there. I've been looking for that for ages. Oh my god. The octopus house, the right place. Octopus house. I think it's done. Super chemistry, Master Fran. Yay. Fran, I finally managed to fix the automatic driver. Do you need any help? I think I managed quite well too, did, did you Fran? Did you? Because I was confused. I did all that you asked of me. Very well Fran, everything seems to be working perfectly. Yes, everything looks absolutely great. What should we do now sir? Well, I wanted to ask if you were afraid of... Um, rabbits there's a little rabbit in one of those rooms and I'm I'm deeply afraid of it would you like to help me get rid of it a rabbit I guess it depends on the rabbit sir with all the right things I've seen I just can't imagine one kind of rabbit is it a chocolate rabbit or one with horns and killer eyes You'll have to see it for yourself. It has a pink nose and blue boots. It's just sitting there. No blinking, no movement. Staring all the time. It does sound very scary, sir. But show it to me, otherwise I'll never know. Brave you are, dear. Follow me now. Cool, so we're following... Eat what? Koi is tall, isn't he? Where am I? There. Oh, yeah, boy. There, see? It's just sitting there. It isn't that strange behaviour. Where? Where is it? Oh, that tiny rabbit. Uh, maybe the rabbit is scared and that's why it won't move? Would you please try and make contact with it? I don't dare touch it. All right, sir, I'll take the rabbit and I'll show you there's nothing to be afraid of. Okay, so I've got to take this bunny. See, it's just a fluffy rabbit. Nothing to be afraid of. Oh, you're right, Fran. There's nothing to be afraid of. <gasps> Bitch! Stole my cat and locked me in. What? Don't go, Mr. Midnight. This is not funny. Oh, great. So it was bad as well now. Carrots. Three. Four. Crap. Okay, there's a number two. Okay, that's what that does. Okay. What's this? Oh! A battery. And a wrench. Light bulbs. A uh, tiny boat, pencil, 
green leaves. What's this? Ah. Oh, okay. Hold on. <laughs> Oops. So that's got power. Okay. Oh god. What am I doing? Clicking on them? Are you? Oh, there's Laster. Mummy, Daddy, who did this to you? Why are you here? Please tell me. Oh, cool. What the hell is this? Oh, God. Then five, three. Five, three. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. No. Okay. That was clearly wrong, apparently. I don't know what the code is. I'm not very good with stuff like this. Um. Jesus. Want a rabbit? Want a rabbit? Want a carrot? We just give this thing infinite carrots. Give this thing infinite. You can give this thing infinite carrots. Uh, okay. So is that six? Oh, do you feed it a carrot and then you can see what's on it? Maybe I don't know. Right. Right. That's a five. That's a six. Eight. Eight, five, six. Eight, five, six, nine, eight. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, I am terrible at this.
Are you kidding me? I oh my lord. Are you telling me that I had to try and work out this stupid, I'm sorry, Kill Monday, but this stupid code when I just could have heard it unlock itself because it clicks. Are you joking? It's like gears on a car or stick shift if you're in America and other places, you can hear when your engine needs to change up and down a gear. Are you kidding me? Is that just a me thing? That you can actually hear when you need the gears changing, like up a gear and down a gear? Anyway, that really wound me up. Brief. And why is the lights off? Surprise, Fran! Happy birthday! Oh, a birthday party? Whoa, I thought you wanted to kill Mr. Midnight. You lied to me. We lied in order to divert your attention in another direction. I'm very sorry I had to fool you, my friend. We wanted to surprise you, dear Fran. Come and eat cake. Alright, thank you, Kitty. You really surprised me. Thank you, Itwood, sir. The cake is made of your favourite ingredients, Mr. Midnight told me which ones. And we have something very special for you from all our members of our ship. That means all of us naturally born or handmade beings. Here you go. I hope you find it educational. Wow, I love the wrapping. Can I open it now, please? Yes, go ahead. Open it. Oh, it's a kitty! Wow, a cat doll! Oh, thank you so much. I love it. It's beautiful. It may give your eyes a new perception, you know, like the ultra reality. Is that what happens when I take the red pills, sir? The ultra reality, what I see. Is that is the ultra reality what I see? Well, it depends on. Would you like an explanation? Yes. Yes, please. Look, what you've seen is a mixture of different realities. And the ultra reality is like an invisible room where everything exists at the same time. For example, at those exact coordinates of time and space, we were having a birthday party. But in the ultra reality, other things are happening all the time. Slower, faster, or just invisible to the human eye. Because of time, humans can define past, present, and future. Defining things encapsulates reality. It gives humans a chance to understand their environment. You have a different perception of the environment. It's not linked to definitions. Do you understand what I'm saying? I'm not sure, sir. I think maybe I feel a bit dizzy. <laughs> that may be the ship going up and down. Blow the candles out now, dear. We're about to reach our destination. You mean we're about to go home? Did you hear that, Kitty? Yes, we're about to arrive. Really? Wow, how exciting. All right, here I go. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh dear, what's happening, Mr. Midnight? Are you alright? I'm alright, but I hope the ship doesn't break. It sounds dangerous. Fran, you have to help. I have to drive the machine again. The automatic driver was destroyed by the Kamalas. There is one left alive. You have to get rid of it. Find it fast. How do I do that, sir? Water that cleans away the dirt. Hurry now, remember, it may be hiding from your eyes. Oh my goodness, Kitty, I'm scared. Me too, Fran. We have to find the Kamala. I really hope the water destroys it. Let's go. Right. Well, I need some water. No, I don't need that. I need water. Water. Cool. Let's go find Kamala Beach. 
Mm, not in here. Where are the frigs of Kamala? In here? Kamala? Nope. Kamala? Why is my game so jibby? Kamala. Ooh, Kamala! Take that. Ah, don't run away. Where are you going? He looked like he was going up, so I'm guessing... The roof? Yes. Okay. No, why have I got a crown? I d even if it works, I wouldn't know what it does. Okay. Oh. Okay. Oh, it's a... There you go, Kamala. I think I finally got rid of the Kamala. I am the best. I shall go back to Itford. Well, I did that quite quickly. Oh no! It would, sir. We did it. The Kamala is gone. It's gone, yes. But it's too late, dear. I can't take you home. We're going down. I'm yelling, Timber! No, please, don't tell me this. It's not fair. Not fair. Is she going to die again? I will always take care of you, my dear. And the ship kept going down until it crashed. Everything was destroyed. The end. But that's a very sad ending, it would. Tell me another story, please. All right, this is the story of Fran, Bo, and me. When she was promised never to forget me or about the magic of everything. Hee <laughs> hee, I promise, it would. I'll never forget you. Good. Now it's time to sleep. Expect me in your dreams, my friend. Doctor's prescription. Oh, little dear. So cute. <laughs> right guys i'm gonna end this episode here um join me in the next one where we will figure out if rambo's actually going home that'll be good and hopefully we can wrap up this game i hope you're enjoying the series and leave a like a like is always appreciated and it's free um take a gander at the other daisy plays that i do or maybe some daisy deep dives whatever tickles your pickle anyway guys i hope you guys have a good time and i'll see you next time Bye.